Hi everyone. Today's uh, video is going to cover a retro bob by Paula Young and her name is Frankie and this is by special subscriber request. So stay tuned. Hi everyone, welcome back. I'm Coco and this is Coco's Hair Solutions. We're going to take a look at Frankie. And this is a short bob, a very, very short bob, and it's a very retro. And she's gonna be reviewed in the color medium golden brown, number eight. So let's go ahead. I have not been able to find her in a catalog, but I did find her online. And this is our young lady right here. Um, if we can kind of get away from that reflection there, can you see that now? That's, that's Frankie. And that's what we're going to be looking at today. Okay. Alrighty. So she's, she came in the box today. We're going to go ahead and open her up and start looking at her dimensions. Let's look at her cap construction. What we have is an open cap construction all across the top and um, front area. That's going to make her for very cool wearing. We have a really nice a velveteen non-itch band across the front hairline. We have open wefts along the sides with metal stays. So you can wear your glasses in them. And of course, there's hair is stitched on the underside of the um ear tabs. We have Velcro adjusters on the right and left in the back so that we can adjust it. And then we have an open extended nape, which adds to comfort, um, keeping your wig in, in the right place and coolness. So let's go ahead and op uh, look at this color, warm, medium brown, just number eight. And that is a really good warm color if you can see the warmth in her she doesn't really have red highlights but it is a warmth of gold and red in this brown that makes her so universal very very nice and of course if you look at the um shininess of the highlights every uh once in a while as the light catches it like maybe right down here you can see some lighter shades of brown almost a golden brown now this color is beautiful it's a universal color and it's one that's used very frequently as um, the darkened roots in a lot of a lot of wigs. This color number eight, it's a really good one. Okay, now let's go ahead and try her on. I'm going to go ahead and take off what I have here. This is Jacqueline Smith's long leading lady in her caramelized brown rooted. Okay, let's go ahead and try this. Okay, so you can see she, oh my gosh, she's kind of cute. I mean, just funky almost. Oh, wow, look at this, all these curls. Now she's meant to have a long sweeping side bang. All right, so we can let it come across the forehead or we can have it come off and up a little bit more, just depending on what you wanna do with her. All right, and she's got lots of good curls. Let's take our brush and kind of loosen up some of these curls here fluff her out and get that that nice wedge look oh you remember Dorothy Hamill and her wedge that was all the rage in the 80s wasn't it was it Dorothy Hamill maybe no it was maybe it was somebody else Dorothy Hamill yeah the ice skater wasn't that it she was so cute okay well let's take a look Alrighty, so we do have, because it's open wefted we don't have a lot of permatees but we do have some and so, you know, if you wanted this to move a little bit more off your forehead, you could take your hair dryer, of course, and blow it up against the hairline to lift, have the, have the bangs or the hairs, the fibers grow up or move up off of the, the edge of the headband. Okay, well, gosh, this is kind of sassy and cute, isn't it? Oh my goodness. Oh, you know, when I looked at this, I thought, oh, it's not going to look that good on me. <laughs> but it's actually kind of cute, isn't it? Oh, it's another short, kind of a, actually, it's got the, all the descriptors that we call a Bixie, right? It's got the nape of a pixie, so it's really short. It's got the long layers of a bob. But this is different. I wouldn't call it a pixie per se or a Bixie per se, but it is a cute short hairstyle, isn't it? Well, how about that? Let's see, let's try and have her go off to the 
the opposite side. We'll see how that goes because she automatically wanted to part from the right going to the left. So let's just see what happens if we want to change that. Well, it doesn't look like she's putting up too big a fight, is she? <laughs> okay. And it looks like you wouldn't lose any of the style. Okay, you might even get a little bit more of a curvature on the bang going away from the face going this way. So that might be a look you want. The cap, it's a little smaller than what I would expect from Polly Young, um, but her caps are starting to, I'm experiencing more and more smaller, um, tighter fitting uh, caps. But this is a very nice, this is very nice. Okay, and even with the bangs like this, you could cut. Oh, now that would be really cute. Cutting bangs all the way across. Wouldn't that be kind of cute? To have bangs all the way across. Oh, I do. I think that would be really cute. Okay, and so to make bangs, you would only want to cut. Okay, so here's the hairline. You would only want to cut bangs into this portion of the wig from this point over to this point, right? Almost from the middle of your eyebrows to the middle of the eyebrow. This center part is where you would cut the bangs. You don't want to cut anything more off of the wig. But, um, Oh, that's really cute, isn't it? This is this is kind of dressy. Oh, and I like this little flippy here thing. The little, yeah, that's very cute. Okay, well, have I done a spin? I don't think I have. Okay, let me do that for you. <laughs> oh, getting sidetracked. Okay, so here she is. How's the back look? She should have some movement up there with those long layers. They're all eight inches up here. Did we talk about that? I don't think we did. Okay, let me look at this. All right, she's 2.7 ounces. She comes in 21 colors in an average size only. The front is six and three quarters inches, so we get enough to sweep off to the side. The top and the crown are both eight inches. The sides are six and three quarters inches. The um, upper back is six inches. Wait a minute, the sides are three and three quarters. The upper back is six inches. And then the nape is two and three quarters inches. But, um, so, you know what? You could, you could actually part her anywhere you want. And just parting her from one side to the next gives you a little bit more height in her styling. So, oh my gosh, that's really cute. She's really darling, isn't she? But I could really see... I could really see cutting bangs into her and that would be darling. So this is Frankie. How do you like her? Let's try a headband. See what that looks like in her. Well, that's kind of cute. Although it doesn't match, does it? But we can actually take some, um, some clips. Of course, my trusty clips, you know, those pretty little things. We could probably pull that up and back. Anything blingy is going to look cute, isn't it? Yeah. Well, let's try a little bit of water and see if we can have anything be different with her in this regard. Okay. Oh, I like putting, putting her back and forth. She's got lots of good body. She does. She's got lots of good body. And she's really fairly dense. I'm surprised. Here we go with those bangs, huh? If I could push them up a little bit. But that gives her kind of a dressy appearance, almost. We could, yeah, this is, this is cute. This is really a cute little wig. I'm surprised. Okay, well, I love this little flippy thing that kind of you can you can accentuate it. You can make it more profound, or you can tone, tame it down. Tone it down. <laughs> very very cute, very cute. So there you go. This is Frankie in the color medium warm brown number eight, and of course she comes in uh, twenty one different colors. So you you've got the your favorite Polly Young colors to choose from. So how do you like her? She's uh she's kind of sassy, isn't she?
Okay. Well, thank you for joining me today. Thank you for my, from my subscriber who suggested this. You're going to see more of my subscriber suggestions in, in my reviews. So stay tuned and stay, <laughs> stay with me. Okay. <laughs> well, we'll see you next time. Thank you so much for joining me. Bye-bye for now. We'll see you. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye.